hello guys in this video we're gonna try to install windows 11 on a one gigram pc now checking the requirements of windows 11 it needs a minimum of 4 gigram 64 bit storage tpm 2.0 secure boot and many other things actually so it is actually impossible to install windows 11 on a one gigram pc but we are gonna do just that so if you're watching this video right now that means we were able to figure it out somehow now we don't meet any of these checks and we are using just one gigabyte of ram so i already have my windows 11 image file iso file over here you can see now i'll also provide a link in the video description in case you just want to install windows 11 on your pc normally or you just want to test it out just like this so we are going to use virtual machine for this test so let's create a new virtual machine click on new let's call this windows 11 hardware 1 gigabyte of ram that should be 1024 okay processor i will just give it three core processor hard disk let's give it okay 71.9 finish back then four gigabytes of ram felt like a flex but now it's actually nothing okay so now i want to add the image file okay so we are about to boot into our windows 11 one gigabyte of ram machine so let's start now this is not a problem with windows but virtualbox itself since we haven't even started the installation so if you're installing on your pc you won't encounter this issue so we're gonna adjust it a little bit just a little bit so let's say 1.1 gig let's try this out this should work now okay now this is due to virtualbox not windows 11 itself we've not even started booting into windows 11 so even if you're using exactly one gigabyte of ram you should be able to boot so let's see if this works out for us and yes it works actually so even if you're using a one gigabyte pc you'll be able to follow up this process and you'll be able to install windows 11 just know that the speed will be terribly bad the best i can suggest for you if you have a low-end pc is to install chrome os and you really love it okay so the language time keyboard let's click on next and then install i don't have a product key um let's go with the pro edition windows 11 pro next and this is the issue you can see we don't meet up to the minimum system requirements to install windows 11 now this is where we have to tweak a little stuff so shift f10 and it would open command prompt then let's go to the registry by entering reg edit go to local machine system setup now let's click on setup new create a new key let's call this lab config now let's create a new d word 32 bits now we are going to bypass the major checks that will not allow us install windows 11 on our pc let me delete this and create okay let me rename this okay now i just have to set the value data to one for each and every one of them to bypass these checks and we are good so i'll just close the command prompt and then install again this should work we hope so 11 pro next and we should be ready to start yep yeah so you can see we can now start the installation so this is custom installation this is our disk next and the installation has started let's see how long this takes so it has been successfully installed the estimated time of installation is about 12 minutes now let's set up
Okay guys, so you can see Windows 11 has been successfully installed on our Wangi Grand PC. Now this isn't that slow as I expected. So let's open the Fi Explorer. This is actually slow but not terrible. Now let's check Tax Manager. And you can see the memory over here 1.1 gig. This is literally 1 gigabyte. Although it is currently using 3 cores. But we can reduce this to 2 cores or even a single core and it would run without any problem. But just know your programs will load really really slow and you may not be able to run some software like Photoshop on your computer. However, it is usable and you can definitely use it. Now, if you have a 1GB RAM PC, I wouldn't advise you to install Windows 11. What I'd advise you to do is install Chrome OS, which will be more smooth since Windows require high memory to run properly. However, this works perfectly. If you want more experiments like this, kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification. Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one.